Hello there, everyone. My name is Ray. Today, we're going to play some more Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. This is part number 21. Thank you for joining me for today's episode. We are going to head to some more worlds to clear out. And then I'm going to start on the next storyline. Well, that is the... That is the plan for today, anyway. Let's go into the rabbit's hole. Don't know why, actually. I should have went to the Queen's Castle. Um, let me see... Matter of fact, let's do that. There's nothing we can do from the rabbit's hole that we weren't able to do already, and it's actually faster to just go straight to the Queen's Castle. In the original Kingdom Hearts, it might not have been, but the uh, loading screens in here are about a blip. So, now, how many, how many more? How many just do we need here? Just, just the one, just the one, okay. Alright, so of course, after we're done rescuing all these little puppy puppy puppies. Hey, cool, white mushrooms. After we're done rescuing all these little puppy puppy puppies, we're gonna go back to Pongo and Perdita and see if they can't let us know what's up. What will they give us? Anything? Nope, that's the wrong one. Come on, fan yourself. Fan yourself! Nope, nope. I'm not gonna do it. I got all day. I got all day. Actually, I don't. I'm kind of on a time crunch. I don't know how long they sit here. Oh my god. You blizzard. You, you, you fanned yourself twice. Thank you. In a row. And then just immediately refused to do it ever again. Blizzard hurts. That's fine. I don't really want to mess with the rest of these. You guys are super cute. You got that one. Alright. Head in here and make the magic happen, baby. Um... Seriously, how the hell do I get up there? There's there's a way where we fall down into here, I think. There's there's a way. Uh, I swear there's there's a, one of the bizarre room exits puts us here. I'm pretty sure anyway. Yo, these guys are just absolutely fodder at this point. Just go away, we're busy. Can't go through there. Can't go through there, it's the same thing. Did I... Leave Goofy alone, bro, you don't want this. We gotta go to a couple of... We gotta go to a couple of worlds, actually. Oh. I don't remember how to get there, obviously. Hits me around here screwing about. Go back to the tea party garden. There's another ability we can... Oh, okay, never mind. We can just... I was going to say, there's another ability where we can just do later on. Oh, God. I don't want to screw this up. Alright, we should be alright. I just don't want to screw this up because if I screw this up, I'm going to have to try and do that again. And it was kind of difficult and annoying for me to do it the first time. I know there's a way to chop down in here, though. So there's the rest of the puppies from this world. Get this treasure chest. And as far as we can do now, we're done with this world. 100%. 100%. Alright, let's get out of here. There's only one more thing we can do in this world. And we have to get the White Trinity to do it. We don't have access to that just yet. Um, basically, as soon as I get that white trinity, I'm just going to leave. Uh, we get access to it relatively early on in another world, but as soon as I get that, I'm just going to leave. Get it all done in one fell swoop. Deep jungle. Let's make it happen. If you accidentally go to fly to another world normally, I wonder if you can just cancel that. And go back to the gummy menu to uh, warp. Like, if you were wanting to warp to a world... But you uh, screwed yourself, you did it wrong. You did it wrong. That wasn't very long. I don't know if I'll cut that or not. I had to uh, answer a question. Someone came into my room to ask me real quick. I probably will not cut that out. One, because I won't remember. Two, because it's not that important. 
fine now. Go up to the treehouse. Make the magic happen. Leave me be. Uh, matter of fact, there's uh quite a few. No, we're not missing any. Okay, we got all the we got all the Dalmatians in this world. I don't know why I thought we were missing a lot in this world. Sorry, team. Yeah, no, you guys were a genuine threat when we first got here. That's one of the other reasons why I like RPGs so much. You actually get a visible show of progression. I don't even know if this is worth it. Mithra. I'd say that's worth it because it's not something we can get any other way. No, no thanks. I'd really just rather you didn't. That's okay with you. Uh, okay. I guess it's not okay with you. I really would rather you didn't. Madam Bouncy Wild over here. Go up. We don't have to worry about support anymore. I did get an upgrade to my items and my accessories, so I can put another accessory on. But uh, I'm waiting for a specific one that we won't get until later on. You see Sora's got an empty spot. So yeah, I could just put on anything. Like this uh, golem chain. Um, it's so weird because it says it raises strength and defense. But you see it raises his strength by three, but his defense by one. So I'm not, I'm not really into that. Just because I don't want to have to... Because I'll, I'll take that off eventually, and it'll just it'll offset my stats. I'm one of those people where if I put on a piece of equipment in an RPG that boosts up a certain stat by a lot, and then I have to take it off later, even if it boosts up another stat by a lot, I just it makes it difficult for me to do so. Like, yo, we are legit in Africa right now. That's the jungle in Africa. This game would have you believe that all these different worlds are not connected. And they're all different Earths, I guess. And of course, I'm just joking. It's a fantasy video game about a kid with a key running around killing demons. Obviously, it's not they're not actually demons. It's not an actual key. It's just a sword that looks like a key and unlocks a bunch of shit. But, you know, the point is, suspend your, suspend your disbelief, alright? The only reason why I say a lot of this stuff that I say is because I'm kind of poking fun at people who actually believe that type of shit. Say, like, bro, this is, first of all, even if you did have a point, it's a video game. They can make it do whatever the hell they want. You don't want to play it, then don't play it. A lot of the... There's a lot of fans of Kingdom Hearts that are fans of Kingdom Hearts. What I mean by that is, like, Game 1 and Game 2, before the game, you know, turned bad or... You know the whole thing, back when it was good. I, I don't plan to, but thank you. Matter of fact, you know what? I'm doing Donald a disservice. I'm doing Donald a disservice. I got number love for you, Donald. Yes, I am leaving to go and check. I want to check if they've got any more weapons for Donald and Goofy. Technically, I don't have to worry about it because we do have a weapon that we'll be getting um, in the next storyline level. And I think I'm going to do this backwards a little bit. <laughs> Since we're here, I'm going to talk to Sid, but I'll have him install that navigation gummy. And then um, we'll go to that world, get access to what I need access to, and then I'll leave, get some power-ups, and then come back. <laughs> Give me the shot, bro. Really? I guess I'm not doing him a disservice. I cannot believe that they still have the same items. That's so stupid. After all this time, all this progression, they still don't have anything extra for him. Sid, talk to me, bro. Looks like you found the other one. Let me see it. Okay, wait here. I'll get it installed right now. I don't know why I'm talking like that. Forgive me. Or don't forgive me. It's your choice. Cutscene, right? Yeah! Now, just remember what Donald said to you. No frowning, no sad faces. 
How can you be so cheerful? There's still no sign of your king. Aren't you worried? I'm worried. The king told us to go out and find the key bearer, and we found you, so as long as we stick together, it'll all work out okay. You just gotta believe in yourself, that's all. Just believe. I believe in you. I don't know where y'all's confidence comes from being so, uh, solid, solid and goofy. <laughs> Donald and goofy. All you guys do is get your butts kicked. I'm healing you guys and reviving you from a bunch of different ass weapons constantly. And don't listen to them, guys. I understand it's good to be cheerful, but it's also okay to be sad from time to time. It's alright to let your emotions show. Don't ever think you're expected to always be happy. That's ridiculous. Long ago, people lived in peace, bathed in the warmth of light. Warmth of light. Everyone loved the light. The people began to fight over it. They wanted to keep it for themselves. And darkness was born in their hearts. The darkness spread, swallowing the light in many people's hearts. They covered everything, and the world disappeared. But small fragments of light survived in the hearts of children. With these fragments of light, children rebuilt the lost world. It's the world we live in now. But the true light sleeps deep within the darkness. That's why the worlds are still scattered, divided from each other. But someday, a door to the innermost darkness will open, and the true light will return. So listen, child, even in the deepest darkness, there will always be a light to guide you. Believe in the light and the darkness will never defeat you. Your heart will shine with its power and push the darkness away. Do you understand, Kyrie? Kyrie? I do, I do, oh, do. How would you, uh, come, uh, come here, little girl version of my best friend slash love interest. the matter um nothing Kyrie did you call me they got me be installed but you know that place is crawling with heartless bro don't say I didn't warn you huh take this transform gummy I don't know what the hell yeah. Let's go into the item workshop, Bjorch! Let's see. What can we synthesize right off the biz at? A whole lot of nothing. Ha. Ah. Can you give me... <laughs> well, we can make Mithril. We just need Mithril stones. What does it do, boy? So we need one more power jump for that. Make it. We need one more power jump for that. I don't know where you get the power gems. Um. Uh, significantly raises max HP and defense. That's something for Donald. Holy crap! Matter of fact. Matter of fact, do that for me. Please do that for me. That's it. Whatever. We gone. We gone. Uh-oh. Why does it even give us the option to look at our party when it's just us? All right, let's head on to the new world. Hold on, Donald. We don't know what's out there. Why don't we visit other worlds first? I'm sure we'll find some new... Bro, that's what I've been doing. Calm it that ass down. Matter of fact... Matter of fact, plans keep changing in this video. I had a clear-cut strategy strategy for what I was going to do. Matter of fact. Matter of fact, matter of fact, matter of fact, matter of fact, let's do this. Come get this work. Come get this work. 
I'm glad that they just let you go up here. In the normal version, you have to like go around and do a bunch of stupid shit. Oh look, it's the rare truffles. Hi guys. I'm not very good at this. I'm not very good at this in like the overworld stuff. I can do this for days in the Coliseum. Aww. I landed on that box. Screwed up my timing. Pretty sure we'll just end up sending this thing off at the edge. If I do this long enough. Mystery. I'll take that. Yeah, I... Ooh. Ooh. Sorry, buddy. Yeah, like I said, not very good at this. But it's all good. I'm not very good, but it's all good. Come here. Oh, okay. That did not work at all how, how I had planned it, how I had hoped. The last one. Yeah, I don't know where the hell that last uh, treasure chest is. I didn't come through here to find the rare truffles. I came here to find that little whatever. There's a, big, there's a big daddy heartless that you guys haven't seen yet. But it's fine. Gummy ship is where we want to go. Um... I like how this is battle level 10. This is battle level 7. Probably gonna get my ass handed to me. A difference between this world and the other worlds is you can't leave until a certain thing happens once you get here. Because you get here, some bullcrap happens. Then you gotta do some other bullcrap to get some other bullcrap so you can leave with some bullcrap. This is it's a bunch of bull. Ooh, that ship is exquisite. Did you see that? Holla at you. Boy, that was actually kind of cool looking. I don't think I've ever seen that one before. Doesn't appear familiar anyway. There's a bunch of crap floating in, in this in this supposed nothingness. Supposed darkness. The way this game describes darkness, too, is just kind of weird. It's a darkness that you don't really have to take seriously. Any, any, it's like, um, a shittier version of the, um, Malevolence from Tales of Hysteria and Tales of, uh, Tales of Hysteria and Tales of Berseria. Because that, like, everything you do causes malevolence in that game. Unless, like, you truly believe in what you're doing. Even if what you're doing would be viewed as evil by other people, it doesn't matter. As long as you're okay with it, you're good to go. And in this game, it's just like, darkness, it's everywhere, it's, you know, super evil and it taints your heart. Don't let it get you. Like, I, I don't know, I just I can't take it seriously. There's a lot of stuff about this game I can't take seriously, though, which is fine, because it's a fantasy game, you play it for fun, you don't really play it to take it seriously. I know there's some people out there who believe in this type of stuff to a large degree, but I mean... On the real, I'm not going around thinking that King Mickey's a badass. Like, Mickey Mouse with a sword is just not intimidating. And I know him and Donald Goofy were the three musketeers at one point. I don't know. There's a, they do that a lot, actually, with RPGs and stuff. You know, you ever notice that? Where, like, the main character is, like, some young, young child fighting against demons and people. It's kind of like how they do in anime. Like in uh, One Piece, you guys ever watch that? Luffy, Monkey D. Luffy is the name of the uh, main hero, I guess. He's not really a hero. He's a decent person. But he's certainly not a hero. He's a pirate who goes around and beats people up and does what he wants. But, there's our next destination. Um, he's 19 right now. And he's fighting people who are like 40, 50. Who have been fighting since before since long before he was even born yet he's still kicking their ass that type of stuff always just confuses me it's like bro you've been fighting for six years and you're fighting someone who's been fighting for 20 or 30 years still relatively in their physical prime how are you even remotely a threat oh he's a prodigy prodigy these nuts Sora's what 14 I think Riku's 15 I know this place Hmm, that's strange. I wonder why. I feel this warmth inside right here. Ah, you're just hungry. Hey, I'm serious, man!
Let's go. I love this level. I don't really think there's anything we can do in this one. Yeah. I, I don't know. I love this level. A lot of people can't stand this level. I love it. We have to... Oh, didn't even see you there. Life gummy. The music. This is the Rising Falls, by the way. Uh, where we're currently at, not the, not the name of the song. I think this will take us over to the one I want to get to. Nope, takes us to the same spot. This, this, the music of this place, the idea of this place, the feel of this place. It's just, it's nice, I love this song. This level can be a bit of a pain in the neck, though. Bizarre, right? This level can be a bit of a pain in the neck, though. There's a... For this game, anyway, there's a good amount of backtracking. Dalmatians 91, 92, 93. Where does this take us? Does this take us to the one I want to go to? Yes, it does. Hurry up. You don't get to stay down here for long. Meteor gummy. Like, even stuff like this, I can see that kind of annoying people. It's like, why didn't you send me back to where I was? You ass jack, now I gotta jump all the way back up top. To the tippy tippy top, to the tippy top. I believe it does the same kind of holler blue and howdy do. Um, it is possible to basically just come straight here, by the way. More or less. You just have to beat Neverland and uh, Agrippa to get here. No you don't have to beat the other no worlds. The so tell me, how'd you get here? I'm the beast, son! Uh, I simply believed. Nothing more to it. When our world fell into darkness, Bell was taken from me. I vowed I would find her again, no matter what the cost. I believed I would find her. So, here I am. She must be here. I will have her back! Take her if you can. Stop! So, you finally made it. About time. I've been waiting for you. We've always been rivals, haven't we? You've always pushed me, as I've always pushed you. Riku! But it all ends here. There can't be two Keyblade Masters. Bullshit! What are you talking about? Let the Keyblade choose. It's true, Master! Maleficent was right. You don't have what it takes to save Kyrie. It's up to me. Only the Keyblade Master can open the secret door and change the world. Which one? There's like a hundred in this game. But that's impossible. How did this happen? I'm the one who fought my way here with the Keyblade. You were just the delivery boy. Sorry. Your part's over now. Here, go play hero with this. Goofy, let's go. We have to remember our mission. Oh, well, I know the king told us to follow the key and all, but... Oh, shut the hell up. You ain't sorry. Get ghost. I don't need you anyway. I got my man with me right here. 
I did not expect the beast to be here in this game at all. And then when he showed up here, I was like, Whoa! <laughs> Beast is awesome. The beast, not beast from the X-Men. Beast from the X-Men sucks. Hey, don't move. You're hurt. Why? Why did you you come here? I came to fight for Bell. Me too. I'm not gonna give up now. I came here to find someone very important to me. Oh, just like that, we got the beast! Oh, I love him. He is so fucking cool. Alright. So the beast is our partner now. Look at that picture. He's so upset. And it's a, like they could not have given you a better partner for this level. They could not have given you a better partner. He is so fucking strong, it is ridiculous. And right now, trust and believe, we're not doing jack. Like, look, look, look at it. A toy sword made of wood. We are not doing jack or squat to the enemies in this place. I love this level. I come to this level so often just to fight. Legit. Just, just, just to run through this place. But, um... Yeah, no. Go down. It's darkness! Look at him! For now, I'm just gonna try my best to go through this place. Um, Beast is just such a daggone strong character! Open that up. Even though I don't have the keyblade, open that up for me, dog. Open that up for me, big dog. Golly, the beast is awesome. Um, this is the one. That's the one that leads us back out. And we're so fortunate that the beast decided to stay with us. And he's literally just got his claws. You know, everyone that we've fought with up to this point, with I guess the exception of... Um, open that so we can have access to it later. I guess with the exception of Jack from Halloween Town. Okay, I'll do the other one first. You don't you don't stay without Donald and Goofy for very long, my dude. I'm actually kinda surprised to let us go here without going to that other world first. Anyway, they've all had weapons of some sort. Jack didn't. He basically was just he's Jack and he's I guess he's got super strong spells or something, I don't know. The beast has just literally got claws. Claws and fangs. And he's just deep in that ass. You can see what he does to these fools. He literally... First enemy we saw in this world. What'd he do? He literally went right through that son of a gun and was done with it. Get it. Get it. Oh, man. The beast is such a cool character. I'm nerding out over this freaking guy. I don't care. You don't have to like it. He's awesome. <laughs> the beast is just... Oh. This is for the platform, isn't it? Ah! With that terrible posture. Beast. The defender. Look how much damage he did to this daggone thing. The defenders look the same. This is basically this is basically the only time or the only stuff that we have to do without the keyblade. Head back to the gates. So yeah, li literally, um, that's it. Now we can just go back to the gates. And uh, because we couldn't we couldn't do anything up to this point, that was weird. We couldn't do anything up to this point because we don't have the keyblade. So we just have one more, one more string of fights that we can go back to the castle gates and do that nonsense. Um, this episode's gonna be a little bit longer, <clears throat> probably about 40 minutes, 35 to 40 minutes. That's what I'm anticipating anyway. 
it's already more than 30 minutes of recording time. Um, now we could go in there. We don't want to just yet. We'll, we'll explore this entire level. Don't worry, I got you. I got you, I got you, I got you. I promise you, we'll explore this entire... Can I? No, I didn't think so. Yeah, like I said, you can't leave. We can't go to the gummy ship. Um, let's go. I mean, I guess just because it's Donald and Goofy's ship, we can't just take it. Even though we can custom make um, our own ships. I mean, I, although I literally don't do any damage to these guys, I don't like to just stand... Oh, okay, they don't do so much damage. I thought they would. I don't like to just stand still and let Beast do every damn thing. Even though he is doing everything. You can kill these things. Like that, I don't know if that was me or Beast. It was probably Beast, but... Man, I, these allergies are really starting to bug, bug, bug me. Activate that real quick. I think we've got some more enemies over here at the front. We examine this to go back to the, the Rising Falls. I'm pretty sure I can just go through this door, right? Yeah, now that it's unlocked. Because if we had come here before, we wouldn't have been able to do nothing. The door is locked, bro. weird to me that I I mean was it always gonna be here or did she have to make that portal thing back there to I don't know they don't really explain it or maybe they do and I just missed it I can feel it. Are you ready for them? Oh, we got this, baby boy. We got this. I feel so sorry for that heartless. That poor little bastard. No, not without Kyrie. The darkness will destroy you. Nice Run, outfit. Riku. The darkness may destroy my body, but it can't touch my heart. My heart will stay with my friends. It'll never die. Really? Well, we'll just see about that. Ah! Fuck what you talking about, Riku legit just tried to kill Sora. Not on your life. But I'm not gonna betray Sora either, cause he's become one of my best buddies after all we've been through together. See you later, Donald! Could you tell the king I'm really sorry? Come on, Goofy! We'll tie him together! Well, you know, I'm the one and right for all. Well, I guess you're stuck with us, Sora. Thanks a lot. Donald, Goofy. How will you fight without a weapon? I know now I don't need the key. Shit, I can still clench a fist. I'll punch you right in your damn My throat. Heart. How's that for a weapon, son? Your heart? What good will that weak little thing do for you? Although my heart may be weak, it's not alone. I still got this wooden sword, too. It's the equivalent of a bat. I bash you inside the head with this bitch. I bet you feel it. I've become part of their I bet you feel it. become a part of mine. And if they think of me now and then, if they don't forget me, then our hearts will be one. I love that pose. I don't need a weapon. My friends are my power. I'm gonna stab you in the gut with this damn wooden stick. <laughs> think I'm out of the game because I don't have the keyblade. Motherfucker, please. Yo, he comes back fully equipped. I call Riku's just like, you know what? F it. This fight is super annoying. Super annoying. And all of a sudden, like, Riku's just like the penultimate bad guy. Like, what the fudge? Legit, why? Look, uh, yeah, thanks, Donald. 
such a, such a good like assist. Where is he at? Damn, Goofy was laying into his ass. Man, I healed up. I swear to God, I did. Why are we fighting each other? We're supposed to be friends. You guys don't know what friendship is. Like, let's beat each other's ass because Kyrie. Neither of us could save her, so we're angry at each other, I guess? Like, what the fuck is even going on? I have no idea why we're fighting. I really don't. Like, even when I sit down and analyze every kind of quote-unquote plot point that we've had up to this point, none of this makes sense. We have no reason to fight each other. And Riku, again, legit just tried to straight-up murder Sora. Like, what the fuck? I don't understand this at all. I mean, you know, we had to three on one him, but. So your heart won this battle. Thanks a lot, Beast. I'm gonna keep him with me. <laughs> White Trinity, there we freaking go. Alright. I know I just said I'm gonna keep him with me, but I'm leaving. Like I said, we're gonna. As soon as we get that White Trinity, we're taking off. Can I hide how much? Oh, okay! Sora with the... I legit think these guys are just called, like, Dark dark Ball or some crap. Oh, my spells aren't doing much nothing to me. Oh! Oh, the Wyverns! Oh, okay. <laughs> the Wyverns look different. Well, they show up. We didn't kill any. Dark Ball. Yeah, Dark Ball. Defender. Yeah, I didn't think... So, the enemies don't show up here until you defeat at least one. Makes sense. Um, these guys... This is the start of the, the ability to pick up um, items that we can actually pick up and use. Wizards! Uh, okay, I genuinely did not mean to do that. The wizards um, drop a weapon for Donald, and the defenders drop a weapon for Goofy. I guess it makes sense. But this is why we had... Um, this is why we had... Oh my god, what is his name? Beast, idiot. This is why we had Beast break down those walls earlier so we could go through here and get the... Whatevers, but we're not going to do that just yet. We're actually going to go through the rest of the game clear out all of the white trinities in them. I'm probably going to start it off in Tarzan's world because that's the furthest one to get to. Um, and then we're going to go to the next actual storyline world. <laughs> I know I said it last time, but it is what it is. So, thank you all for watching as always. My name is Ray. Go ahead and follow me on Twitter if that kind of thing interests you. The link will be in the description. Let me know what you thought about this video. Um, I'm trying to do a little bit different style in the way that I play and the way that I commentate. More so the stuff that I would say or do when I'm on my own as opposed to like trying to be for like an audience or some kind of shit. But anyway, until next time. Goodbye everybody.